Hey, hey, hey. I hope you guys enjoy these, what I'm calling podcast shorts for my burnout to all out community. This is just a little peek behind the curtain of the coaching that goes on inside of my programs. We're bringing to you some of the best nuggets and coaching I'm giving within hot seats of all of our different programs, whether it's our LinkedIn Method Academy our mini mastermind business basics, all the way up to our higher level mastermind. If you're hearing some of these questions and you're like, man, I wish I could get my burning question answered by Melissa. Hey, guess what? You could be featured on my podcast. If you've got a question that you want answered and you submit it to my team and we pick it, we will bring you here to the podcast for our podcast shorts and uh, do a hot seat with you. Where can you submit your questions? Send them to teamburnouttoallout.co. We'll make sure we drop that in the show notes for our podcast shorts. And I hope that you guys find as much value in these shorts as our clients do inside the program. Need some effective tactical advice that actually helps you get results and makes a real difference in your life and business? You've come to the right place. If you're finding yourself here today, it means you're getting ready to gain serious traction in your business, rapidly multiply your income and impact, and you're ready to make it happen while living all out. Guys, I'm Melissa Hanal, your trustworthy corporate dropout turned six-figure business burnout turned happy and healthy CEO of a multi-million dollar online business, and you're listening to the Burnout to All Out podcast. On this show, we're serving up innovative growth strategies, simple implementation methods to put them into practice, and action-stimulating inspiration tailored specifically for the modern entrepreneur. Let's dive in. I think my next plan is to, and you know, it's, I even did it without like a whole social media plan and email. But finally, I'm like, I'm going live, like heck or high water. I'm just doing it. I'm pushing the live button because I was finally able to kind of figure some of the tech out. So my plan is to really try and get like at least some kind of email or get it onto some kind of launch sequence. But I'm thinking of doing an upsell with it, like a smaller upsell for $7 where people can purchase like Canva templates to create carousels. Yes. Yes. That's my next plan. Yes. I love that. I love that. And then how do you get it out to the masses? That's the question is what should I be doing to get it out to the masses? I think that that's what I could really use some help or guidance or just to kind of get out of my own head with. Yeah. Well, I mean, there's, gosh, there's a million ways to Sunday, right? Like (laughs) there's a number of different ways to get it out there. Obviously the long game would be building like an email list that you can market Mm. it to at a certain series in the email funnel. So like one of the strategies, and of course talk to Jackie, but one of the strategies could be like a free opt-in to get them onto your email And then creating a little bit of nurture that creates value, value. And then after a series of emails, after a couple of tips or tricks around branding, copy, marketing, you're saying, hey, for $7, you can get this, right? So now that's going to become more and more lucrative as you grow your email list, right? And then also thinking bigger picture, like from a course creation perspective, like One of the things we're looking at doing with our evergreen funnel that we're building right now is there's so many places along the journey that we're going to upsell. So when people opt into like a lower ticket, like course or set of modules or client experience with you, whatever it is, there can be a drip based off of what people opt into that you were then upselling them for, right? So mm-hmm. you could do a free webinar on XYZ and then there's an email drip from collecting emails from doing the free webinar that you're dripping and you're selling stuff. I mean, it's ever ending. The other thing is ultimately we're kind of in this evergreen space right now. Is it worth running ads for? Depending on the price point, you'd have to look at your return on investment, Like for our, I'd have to check with Dorothy, but right now our LinkedIn checklist, which we're doing for free, 
I don't know how it would convert if we charged for it, but I think we're paying like two or three dollars per click, right? For the checklist for per download. So what might be interesting is again, I don't know if it'd be worth running ads for or not. It could be that it's just totally like an evergreen. If you pay two dollars for the lead and you get twenty nine dollars, like anywhere yeah. in the bank, that would make sense, right? Totally. So, and so that's what I'm working through in my head right now, right? Because we just launched our first evergreen webinar and we got a 2.66 return on investment. My brain's trying to play with that because I'm like, okay, so we paid $3,000 for the ads and we made whatever the math is on that, like 9,000 or something along those lines, a little bit less than 9,000. But when you start to scale that, right, the return money. on that is way better than anything you can get in a bank. Right? So it just it depends on how you want to get it out there, you know? Thanks guys so much for listening in on today's podcast episode. And I can't wait for you to see my upcoming guest in the next episode. You are going to love this keynote speaker. Hey, here's the deal. If you liked this, please subscribe and leave a review. And you want the latest online business growth strategies and exclusive LinkedIn pro tips sent straight to your phone? Text the word UPDATE to 704-318-2285. That is text the word UPDATE to 704-318-2285. Can't wait to see you guys. Come find me over on Instagram, LinkedIn, Facebook, wherever you like to hang. I cannot wait to hear how you are enjoying and applying what you're learning. You guys reach out to me over on social because I love hearing what's resonating with you. When you reach out to me and you send me those personal DMs, they really do impact the content I continue to bring forward to you. So again, come find me, Melissa underscore Hinault over on Instagram, Melissa Hinault over on LinkedIn and Facebook. Can't wait to see you guys over there.